Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is just some quick little project shares using some of my design team dies from KS Craft, which is on AliExpress. All my dies, I used the Hey Santa collection by Crate Paper, which I absolutely love. And I need to order more of it because I'm figuring out I'm using a lot of it. The sequin mix, you guys saw me post a video the other day using my Creative Mojo Wholesale Studio like bits and bobs. So the first thing right here is this penguin shaker. I didn't make the Santa one, just the penguin. And he is so, well, she is so cute. I added little Nouveau drops to the cheeks. Um, I just did the eyelashes instead of like the open eyes. Um, I actually used a present from the sleigh die. I didn't get to play with the sleigh yet, but I used the present. This little bow was gifted to me in a challenge like a year or two ago. Um, pom pom trim I added to the scarf that's already part of the die and I added some of that shaker mix to the inside and it just turned out so cute just like a little whimsical penguin penguin girl used this die this is the A2 envelope and it comes with all these different words um, I didn't use any of those words because I made my envelope a Christmas theme and this is what I did I just used 110 pound cardstock for the base of it. Um, I did go ahead and run this through again. I ran this piece through again and I cut um, that piece right, I cut all the stitching off. And that way it made a layering piece, which is this pattern paper. And then I did it again for this top flap. And it flaps open like this, so it's an envelope and then you stick your A2 size card in there. I'm not a card maker really. Um, I've made a few cards, but I didn't know what I was doing. And then I did use, KS Craft, these are, I think these are from last year, or was it, I don't know which, when, a different release, but there's a fa la 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 there's a Christmas one, so I just used the Christmas, I like the size and the font of these, I went ahead and did some stitching across it, I used some of my um, crinkle paper, this is from Crystal from Halloween, it has orange, but it got covered up, so that was a good thing. Um, I added some pom-poms, I used a little chipboard and ephemera pieces, um, a little, um, stamp style one in the back ephemera vellum and i added oh my gosh these little snowflakes i feel like i've been adding them to everything they are from my girl ariel's shop snowflake gems and added that right there and this is in you can stick other stuff you can stick like a memory dex in here and the last one that i used for the night is this one, a sock like holder, like packaging basically. I didn't have, I don't have any Christmas socks. I haven't found any Christmas socks at Target or Dollar Tree. But basically you get the, the two socks are usually pinned together at the top and you would just put that up inside of here. And like for instance like this, and you would have your socks hanging down below. Super cute, I cut it out in the pattern paper. This is cut out in 110. I stitched everything, um, paper piece, the cozy wishes. This little bow was gifted to me, but I added a little snowflake to make it more um, Christmassy. So once I find Christmas socks, I can do these. All right, those are my quick little project shares for today, and I will catch you guys on the next crafty video. Bye, guys.